I think it's important for us to recognize law enforcement and firefighters every now and then because they do make extraordinary sacrifices in order to protect our communities. Unfortunately, a Stockton, California firefighter was killed while responding to a fight to, to a fire. All right. Also, uh, a, a, a Vancouver, Washington off-duty police officer was actually killed as well. Okay, now let's start with the firefighter. A 21-year fight. A 21-year veteran of the Stockton Fire Department died Monday after being shot while responding to a dumpster fire in the city, officials announced. Captain Max Fortuna, Fortuna, hope I pronounced that correctly, 47, leaves behind a wife and two grown children. Firefighters were responding to reports of a dumpster fire in the area of Aurora Street and Washington Street when gunshots were heard and Fortu Fortu Fortuna was struck, officials said. He was taken to a nearby hospital shortly after the shooting, where he later died. I want to say rest in peace to this man. We live in America, and, um, you know, quite naturally, we do have some social issues going on with law enforcement and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, these people are heroes. These are people that dedicate themselves to protecting us, you know. It's human reaction. It's human nature to run away from a problem, to run away from chaos, to run away from uh, a dangerous situation. But these people run towards these situations because it's their job to protect us. It's their job to protect their communities. And I think that they should be recognized for it. I think that they should be held in high esteem for it. And I think it's important for us to recognize them when they die in unfortunate situations like this. Now, for this police officer, an off-duty Vancouver, Washington police officer has died after being shot at his, homes, at his home. The circumstances of the, of the officer's death remain unclear, but local reports have identified the officer as 52-year-old Donald Sahota of the Vancouver Police Department. My heart goes out to Officer Sahota's family and friends and those of us in his VPD family as well, Vancouver Police Chief said. Fox News has reached out to the Vancouver Police Department and Clark County Sheriff's Office seeking more information and will update this, this story shortly. His death is being investigated as a homicide, of course. You know, um, yeah, you know, this is just a simple video. And like I said, I just want to let anybody out there know who's in law enforcement or, you know, anybody who works for the fire department that on behalf of my community and, and on behalf of my family, we appreciate the service that you give. I think it's uh, it's tremendous. I think it's wonderful that we have people in our society who are willing to confront dangerous situations to protect us. And that's admirable, and that's a wonderful thing. Rest in peace to these two men.